okay good morning students i have come to inform you that tomorrow you all are going to be taken to a movie theater for a movie okay so classes 7 and 8 are requested to reach at 11 and 10 pm respectively and the food would be provided there any doubts no, sir. okay thank you students Students of classes 7 and 8, please be seated at your respective places as we are going to start up with the movie. Put your hands up. Surrender yourself. What? You new here? I don't get you. Are you coming to the jail for the first time? Obviously, yes. So, whom did you kill? I didn't kill anyone. Come on, tell me. You think I'm lying? <laughs> All criminals are the same. A thief never says that he has stolen something. By the way, how did you come to the jail? RDX smuggling. And uh, maybe a murder of 20 to 30 people? Now I can really believe that you did not do any kind of crime. <sighs> My plan is to escape this jail within three months. What? Why do you need to escape the jail? Can't you wait for the release? I got 20 years of imprisonment, kid. Do you want to escape the jail with me? No, I am going to wait for my release. Oh, Alright. I'm going for a nap now. And it's better that you go to sleep as well.
you're still awake. I'm making a small explosive which can break the walls of this jail in a second. <sighs> I'm going to sleep. Why are you staring at me like that? You are working on this since three months. Why don't you just go and snatch the keys from the jailer? He sleeps all day long. <laughs> that jailer. It's not that easy kid. They are very much acquainted with this job of prisoners. How many more months is this going to require? How many more months? This is going to be ready by tomorrow. Well, what did you decide? Are you joining me to the escape? No. As you wish, kid. Do you want to escape? My the jail plan is to me. escape this jail within three months. I was twenty years of imprisonment. Are you kid. going to escape the jail with I me? Twenty years of imprisonment. My plan kid. is to escape this jail within three months. Huh. I'm ready to get out of here. Are you going to come out with me? No. All right. Have a look at my magic. Wait. Let's go. So, how was my plan? Cool. So, did you all enjoy the movie? So, can anyone explain me what's the moral of the story? No one? Yes, we have got Rahul there. The movie brilliantly brings out to us the theme of what accompaniment does to us. As we can see, in the very beginning of the story, the common man has a thought of an honest person who is bound with the decision of the authorities, but later gets to join the company of a murderer who wants to escape the prison against the laws. The subject is initially stuck at his decision, but later changes his decision and tries to escape the jail, which leads him to join into a deeper trouble. Thus, we can conclude saying, what accompaniment does to a person, whether it be a good or bad company, it does a great difference in our way of living. That was excellent. Very good. Give a huge round of applause for Rahul. Hey Rahul. <laughs> I have got your hearing device. How were you going to watch the movie without them? Is the movie over? Nice speech, brother. Thanks, brother. Speech? You give a speech, but you did not have your hearing device with you. Being a deaf, how can you understand the entire movie as well as what people are speaking to you? I mean, how is that possible? <laughs> you are wondering how did I get the movie even after being deaf? So let me tell you. 
The art of listening is not about what we hear, it's about what we perceive. To be well performed, it requires more than just letting sound waves enter passively into our ears. Good listening is an alive process demanding alert and active participation. It is in a sense a mental skill which is developed primarily through training and practice. We must inquire about all the basic essential of productive listening and that done, we must practice faithfully until we have mastered the techniques. So, do you still believe that we require ears to inherit the art of listening? Think again. <laughs>